Hello everyone, welcome back, welcome back to Marvelous Beauty World. Here I am again back with another new video because a lot of people have been asking me like if I can share Caro Light, how to mix Caro Light or Caro White. So the video today so is going to be about this Caro Light or Caro White because some people they use Caro Light but some people they use Caro White. So today video will be talking about how to mix this one because there's a lot of people who have been using Caro White or Caro Light. They have like a problem, they have like blemishes, they have like skin problem. But today I will show you the safe and then the good way to use it because you know sometimes using those hydroquinone like, cream is not good. But you know if someone already tested, try it they see how it lightening the skin so honestly you can't stop them so the only thing you can do at least give them the advice on how to use it so in today's video i will share with you how you can mix it to get a nice skin smooth and then clean and nice so if you're excited to see how i'm gonna do it keep watching much love man mm -hmm. Yeah, guys. As I told you today, video so we'll be sharing how to uh, to use Caro Light or Caro White because there's a lot of people who have been using it uh, abusedly. So they abuse themselves. They have like you know pigmentation and skin, and then they have like damaged skin. So today I will show you how you can use it safely and that you don't damage your skin. So that's the Caro Light here. So we've got our oil here, vitamin C. So bright face oil. So it's here. So the oil is here with vitamin C. And then we've got the avocado oil so as you know the avocado has a lot of properties so it helps you like to smoothen your skin and then to nourish your skin and then we need like the anti pot here so a plastic bowl here and then a spoon so always make sure when you are using these things so use plastic plastic stuff don't use anything made to because it's no good like for health and safety and then we need our chia butter here so the chia butter is here it's kind of like stock so we're gonna go and then melt the chia butter in the macro air. so i'm gonna go and melt it and then i'll come and show you guys if you you use caro white or caro lights please you know drop us a comment how you use it so we want to know we want to share sharing is caring so that's the way i mix it i don't know how you you mix it if you feel this video is interesting guys please give us a thumbs up like and share sharing is caring i always say sharing is caring so i'm gonna go and melt the chia butter and then i'll come back to show you how i'll be mixing it i'm gonna mix it in front of camera so everyone will see how you can, can use caro light or caro white without of having like bad skin or dry skin or damaged skin i don't i'm not gonna waste your time let me see you I told you so today we'll be sharing how you can mix your caro light or caro white you know to to have a nice glow skin and with not having problem so the caro light is new so i don't use caro light i'm just mixing for one of my uh, sister you know i don't i don't use caro light so if you want to know the cream i'm using so you just let me know so i'll drop the name of the cream for you in the description box so the caro light is new so i'm gonna open it and see is here brand new so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna mix it with the shea butter so the shea butter is here so i did melt it in the microwave so i honestly go ahead put like a, a good amount of shea butter because this thing the caro light is so thick and then you don't want it too much honestly so you want too much of a uh, share butter because it's gonna help you to nourish and you know replenish your skin so you just go maybe get one spoon so as you can see two spoon three and four spoon of caro light so i think for uh, the quantity of this share butter is okay so put three spoon of a uh, caro light don't put caro light too much guys it's so thick and then the amount of the hydroquinone inside is too much so you don't want to damage your skin okay so you go with your vitamin c so vitamin c face well is there so you can use this for the body as well one two three four five six seven eight nine ten you put ten drop of vitamin c in so it's very good vitamin c is good to help you with your skin you know when you are using things like carolite which is as like a a good amount of hydroquinone 
and then you go with avocado oil avocado oil is very good because it's gonna help you like to nourish and then replenish your skin while you are using this hydrating of things you put one two three four five drops of avocado oil and then so you see i did put the shea butter first and then i add three spoon of carolite and then i put 10 drop of vitamin c and then i did put five uh, drop of avocado oil so all of this we are just doing it like to tone down the dose of carolite because carolite is very strong is very strong the thing is so thick as you can see our mixing so see that so now i'm mixing the shea butter that i melted with the caro like you guys see so mix mix until you see everything become so smooth so you don't see any lump or anything of the the caro like or any thickness of the caro like that means so the cream is nice so you just mix you know keep mixing so don't stop yourself keep mixing until everything mix in one and then it gets just so smooth just keep mixing you see after me mixing the uh, shea butter with my avocado oil with the vitamin c you see how it looks so that's why i was telling you just don't put too much carolite just put a small quantity but put a generous amount of shea butter because it's gonna help you like to smooth down the thing you see so it's nice and light so when you use it this way at least you tone down the amount of you see that see how smooth it look on the skin so because since it's too thick and then with the hydroquinone if you use it on its own or you use like different oil as well so it's gonna make you look good and nice lightening the skin maybe one three months but within time so it's gonna start like drying out your skin and then damaging your skin and then you don't want that to happen so if you want to use it use it this way i've seen some people mixing carolite with water you can mix the cream with water because the way they did it so it's not meant to be mixing with water so get instead of water give get to shea butter mix it with shea butter shea butter you see how it's gonna give you a nice you know skin texture and then you can be using your carolite mix maybe use it one week you use it like a week you use carolite after one week you use like a normal cream which doesn't have hydroquinone inside and then you switch and then you go back so that way it's gonna help you like to save your skin and then it doesn't get any damage on your skin you see that so some people when they are used to their lightning cream you know you can't stop them but at least giving them advice which is gonna help them like to use it safely i think is what just we need to to do so the cream is ready to use so you're just gonna close it and then it's ready to use so yeah guys that was how you can you know safely use your car lights and then it doesn't damage your skin i can't stop you like don't use it no you are already addicted to it i can't but the only thing i can do i think i can give you advice so that's the way i mix it so if you use car lights as well please share with us tell us how you use it how you mix it so thank you so much for your time thank you for watching we appreciate you please guys keep sharing this video keep subscribing let's make this family marvelous family get big and bigger so if you are new here we share some beauty tips we share some makeup family lifestyle you know all of that we thank you so much for your love for your support we appreciate you so yeah have your nice glow skin with carolite safely so that's what was like the video today i love you so much i'll see you on my next one bye